I think I'm gonna do a showcase video, but <laughs> this is actually a Vault Temple map. And I real I realized I don't really like Vault Temple. So <laughs> as in I don't like the farming strategy. I mean it's cool when you have a pretty rare drop, but I'm not doing crucible for this. Well, I can, but I don't think I have the slots for it. So one of the reasons why I usually like a very um elk and go kind of playstyle is because if your drops are primarily like bubble gum currency you don't really have to think about pricing things and looking at items this one you have to because literally everything that drops has to be priced in order for you to like uh, make a profit <laughs> I mean you can probably make a crap ton of a profit it's just you literally have to price everything like you can't just like get a stack of something and then uh you know right. This is for the what okay, I, I take it back. I really like this uh <laughs> I really like this farming method. Oh god, that's for the vines, really? Holy shit. Yeah, the uh, Vault Temples are really good, you know. I'm I'm uh I'm completely sold on this idea. Mm. Literally my third Vault Temple, alright, let's go. I guess I can just skip the crucibles because like the marginal like you're really just going for the big gambles right whatever comes out of the, the chest I mean from the vow uh, vessels you don't really quite care about everything else think that's useful at all. all right. So that's the other thing also I end up picking a lot of rubbish because uh, my filter can't really uh, decide which double corruption is great or not great and so uh, and I don't want to hide single corruptions. Uh, I could actually just configure a good filter but I can't imagine spending time not playing the game. So. So smart to leap into that, I think. Mm. 
You know, with the number of rogue exiles I'm getting, make, it would make sense to get some of the rogue exile. That's Ice Nova. Oh wait, that's an altar. Can you open a portal or murder at the end? Uh, please like. This is pretty crap. Fire is fine. Cold is eh. Yep, yep. Anyway, all weapons. I think all weapons are pretty garbage. Like it doesn't really matter because the weapons are. You can't uh, put trees on them, and if you can't put trees on them, they're bad. So. I really need to free up a dumb tap and then this can be a lot more efficient. So what I wanna I guess is to pick up all the things that are currency based and then things that aren't currency based I have to uh Okay this is three point five divines apparently. Uh let's put this three divines. Ah three point four. Wait, this is 4 elemental damage per power charge. Okay, this is actually 4 divines. Uh, let's make it 3.8. Alright. Okay, so I guess I can do another one. Otherwise, uh, it'll be point and pointless. So I guess I just need to figure out how to optimize this. Uh, that means I don't do the crucibles uh, because uh, crucibles are a waste of my time and also because uh, nothing really on my LS3 does benefit me doing crucibles. Okay, divination cards, uh, quantity, yeah but that's... Okay. Reduce chill, energy shield, recharge, and all that sucks. The only uh, temples I'm not doing are Ellie Reflect because. I haven't solved the problem with the uh, Tempest sh Shield yet. Also, since I've hit 90, I'm not concerned about leveling. Uh, 99, I mean. Okay. I have no intention to level. That is a explosion. I like. I don't want to level the hundred. I think it's too much effort. I'm usually just happy in 99. One extra point is not like part of my equation. Not 
Golden Cassia. Is that Harbinger? Yeah, it's Harbinger. I need to stop picking up uh, non double corrupted. Double corrupt. And then the corrupted gems, I need, they need to be double corrupted for it to be worthwhile, so I need to stop picking up the ones that are not double corrupted. Single corruptions are kind of cringe. I'm not sure if hobbies are worth it as well, I might unspec our hobbies. configure the filter pick out all these six sockets are kind of cringe Duration and we'll cry. Sounds meh. Okay. Not sure if I should pick up six links. Yeah, I'm really not sure if I should pick up six links. Doesn't feel worth it to pick up six links. I guess the downside of this. Really, the downside of this uh, strategy is that you really have to spend a lot of time looking at things. It's kind of annoying. Pick up, stop picking up the sacrifices, like the fragments. I don't know. 
Moment, habt ihr es nicht. All right, that's about it. I'm gonna probably do more of these and then we'll see how it goes. I might, I mean, <laughs> oh, it's so surprising to see like this being worth so much. The will clash, where the fuck is it? I don't know, somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I'm surprised that this is like worth so much. Mm. Oh, that being said, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to continue farming this. I have, if you want to see how many temples I have for this, <laughs> I spend a lot of time buying temples out. So <laughs> I, I have a lot of them to uh, to farm. Yeah. All right. Peace. See you guys. I'm out.